Vegas, baby. You we know we did Vegas, baby. I cannot believe we made it to the United States. There's a big smile on Fela. Hey. <laughs> Big push, baby. <laughs> We're about to board our flight. We need to hurry up. We're like one of the last people boarding it because Qatar Airways made it really hard for us to check yeah, in this morning. It's been a very, very hectic morning. Yes. So we're going to touch base with you guys and explain everything when we get to Doha Airport. It's probably going to be about a five to six hour flight. So we'll see you guys soon. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Very good. One eight sixty. It's a sweet Doha flight. Thank you. Eight three seven. Destination Doha. Connecting flights. A flight time to Doha will take six hours and thirty minutes. Doha to Doha. The route looks okay. We'll cruise at an altitude of forty thousand feet. Please wear your mask at all times while aboard and with reception when you're taking your meals since for the safety of everyone. Uh, see you already know. Thank you for choosing Qatar with the Gary 350 operation to know how we're going to work. We just arrived in Doha at Ahmad International Airport. We were actually meant to do this intro back in Bangkok, <laughs> but we had such a stressful check-in and so many complications that mm -hmm. there was no time to fit that in. But enough talk about that, and let's tell you where we're going and how we're doing it. Tell them, baby. So as you guys can see by the title, we're gonna be traveling from Bangkok all the way to Las Vegas. This is gonna be a 30-hour travel journey, our longest ever journey ever whilst yeah. traveling. We just had a six and a half hour flight from Bangkok all the way to Doha, so we have arrived here safely. We had an amazing flight with Qatar Airways. We had the flight at 3 a.m. so we needed to catch up on some sleep, mm -hmm. just have some food. Now we're waiting in the transit area and we're going to be having a 15 and a half hour flight all the way from Doha to San Francisco. What? That's going to be a crazy flight. Crazy. 15 hours guys, 15 hours. And we're going to be flying with Qatar Airways so we look forward to showing you what that flight's going to be like. And once we arrive in San Francisco it's a four hour layover then we're going to be flying with Alaska Airlines one and a half hour journey all the way to Las Vegas, baby. The other thing I really, really loved about our journey to here is that one of the air hosts recognized us and actually gave us a really cute card just supporting our channel and giving us such good vibes and that made my morning like yeah. completely. The cherry uh, in the top. Yeah, it was, it was amazing. We want to say a big thank you to Shulo because she's so sweet. As soon as she met us, she invited us to be her two guests at the lounge. She's so sweet. We're honestly. not there right now because it's really quiet in there so we felt it would be rude to just be speaking loud to yeah. our camera. <laughs> but we're going to go and head over there now, we'll spend the rest of our transit stay in there and show you what it is that we can eat and find. Let's go, baby. Guys, they have a whole game room with a PS4 in there. That is incredible. If I had more time, I'd definitely be playing in there right now. They also have an internet room with IMAX in there. So if you need to do any work, if you need to print off any visas or any important documents, you got everything you need in there. We actually just ate in the plane, so we're not hungry. So he just got a little juice, and I got my favorite sparkling water. We got free drinks. <laughs> You're literally the last people boarding a flight right now. This is actually insane. Have you ever been the last one boarding a flight? I have never been the last. I leave that stuff to my mom. She's the drama queen. We had to go through a few checks and uh, get everything sorted. So and there was a couple complications yeah. again, but. We all now good. We made it, so I'm happy. I'm excited for this 15-hour flight. Yeah, Qatar Airways are one of the best airlines in the world, so we look forward to seeing the experience and what they have to offer on their airline and showing you guys as well. Yeah, so let's hurry up though, because uh, we don't want to be the rude one. Oh, oh. <laughs> 
Are you okay? <laughs> Sorry. Everyone's gonna be staring at us. <laughs> rush, rush. Good morning, sorry good morning. everybody. 4287 case, good morning. Good morning. Allow me, pleasure, right Thank here. Thank you so you. much. I'll be going to the fourteen one. Okay. Yes, sir. Oh wow. You see some for us, unfortunately. <laughs> So instead of the crew making these announcements, they do it on the screen, which is really cool, with the football team. And I think it just keeps the engagement, because it's actually quite funny as well. Ready as you are, my ticket? Pleasure, may I offer a my ticket for you? For our 15 hour flight, we get some pillows. They're not too bad, they're quite comfortable. We get covers, and because Dante and I have the whole road to ourselves, we get three covers. They also give you a protective kit, so you get hand sanitizer, mask, and some gloves. It's good to stay safe. They give you some headphones, and you can plug them in right here. They also give you some amenities. Let me show you what comes in this goodie bag. Oh, wow. So you get toothbrush and some toothpaste, earplugs. I need these because Dante snores so much. <laughs> Just kidding. Then you get some socks. Oh my god. Usually you only get treated like this in first class so I really love all the amenities they're giving you out here in economy. <laughs> they also give you a mask to sleep so that no light gets in. Also if the pillow isn't enough for you and you want to you know sleep on one side or the other you can actually adjust this. I love that. Maybe you want one to be like that. But I think for me, I like it like this. And then, wow, oh, this is beautiful. Just follow the simple on-screen instructions to register and start surfing. Stay in touch with the world with Qatar Airways state-of-the-art onboard Super Wi-Fi. Just a quick update for you guys. We're currently one hour into our flight. We just got served brunch. We got a really nice dish. We got sweet and sour chicken. We got a little fruit pot and some yogurt in the pot as well. I'm not gonna eat it because I'm not a yogurt fan, but I am gonna eat the bread loaf. I'm not sure what flavor it is. Yeah, it looks good, like though. my lips delicious, <laughs> yeah. Something I've been spending the past hour just playing Angry Birds, but it's, it's so, so addictive. addictive. Oh, like, I think goodness. I'm gonna be playing for the whole 15 hours. Like honestly, I just wanna do all the levels and get like um, three stars of all the levels. <laughs> They've also got a great movie selection, so if you don't wanna play games, then you've also got really amazing I think after the food, I'm going to tune into a movie selection as well. You reckon? Yeah. they got a really nice Marvel selection and I love Marvel, oh. so I'm going to be watching all the Marvel series. Let me show you. Right there. 
charge off your phone. Just like that. I'm not entirely sure what this is for. I think it's like a contactless thing maybe with the menu, but we haven't used it yet, so I'm not entirely sure what it does. Then you've got a little drop down tray here, fully extendable, just like that. Just a nice click on, and let me just show you what they have here. It's really amazing. So you've got the whole entertainment system, swipe up just like that, movies, TV, audio, and then games as well. You also got camera views where you can see the cameras on the plane, just like that. Crazy. And then you can also track your trip, so you can go on flight map and see exactly where you're going across the world using 3D maps. If the person in front of you puts their chair back and then your screen is tilted, all you have to do is pull the screen out like this. So it's a very simple but effective display system. It has everything you need. You need to charge your stuff, you've got it right there. You need entertainment, it's all within this screen right here. So it's a thumbs up from me. We just got woken up from our nap with some dinner. This is our last meal before we land. We have two hours left. bathroom right now it's not a big bathroom but it has enough space it does the job LED lights at the bottom I'm gonna brush my teeth with the toothbrush and toothpaste that they give us this is actually a really cool toothbrush I like this it's got a nice firm brush cool toothpaste with the sink this is the first time I've seen a sink like this Just press it like that and then the water comes on you can turn up the heat you can turn down the heat you got some hand wash some eau de toilet, I'm guessing that's perfume. I'm not sure if it's for you or for the toilet to make a small knife, I'll you. <laughs> I'll just brush my teeth, the toothpaste is amazing. It has that mini taste to it, which I really love. Because some small toothpaste can be a bit matty. I wash my face as well, so I'm looking fresh, I'm feeling fresh, ready to land. We've got 45 minutes until we land in San Francisco. It's gonna be so crazy. I'm gonna spray a bit of this eau de toilet, just, you know. Freshen up the place. Not sure if that's what it's for, but you know. <laughs> so close. Ten scrappy, minutes. I am excited. I'm like, my nerves are all over the place. I'm listening to music to just relax. <laughs> how you feeling? We in the USA. That's how I'm feeling. It's gonna be crazy. We wish you a pleasant stay in San Francisco or a safe journey to your final destination. Got their airways going places together. Thank you and a very good afternoon. Guys, we just landed in the United States of America. It's gonna be so much fun. I'm so excited. We're gonna go through immigration, through all the checks, and then catch up with you once we're here. I cannot believe we made it to San Francisco. Wow. We made it past security, past immigration. We had a 15 hour flight, a six hour flight before that, which means we've been flying for over 21 hours. And we're still up and alive. Up and alive, Breathing. and we still got one more flight to go. In regards to our 15 hour flight, that was crazy. I still Whoa. cannot believe that we pulled through that. It actually didn't even feel like 15 hours. Like between sleeping and just watching movies, it just kind of went by. I think I watched about four movies, which took <laughs> up about two, four, six, eight, eight hours of the flight. And I finished playing Angry Birds and got <laughs> three stars on all of them. She smashed it. You guys can see right here that she got 18 out of 18 on yeah. all the countries you bang oh, out. I, I loved it. <laughs> Let's get to the juicy bit though. What was your favorite thing about flying with Qatar Airways? Oh, it has to be the food and the entertainment. If there was no mm. entertainment, then I'm not sure how I would have coped because Makes I don't want to listen to music the whole flight. 
so the movies really helped and because they didn't just have one good movie yeah. they had like All the good every movies. good movie yeah. and they had one Batman but they didn't just have one Batman they had Batman 1, 2, 3, 4 wow. so I could just watch the whole series I, was like, I yes. love that yeah for me it was definitely just the food like the fact that we kept getting fed every like two hours I loved it I felt like a baby like I, just yeah, feed me I told <laughs> Dante time. I feel like I ate more in that 15 hour flight than I've eaten in the past months basically <laughs> they're just feeding you here you go here you go, here you go. <laughs> comment down below if you'd fly with Qatar Airways from what you've seen in our video yeah they are recognized as the best airline in the world so let us know from the videos that we took do you think they're the best airline in the world comment your opinions down below we're now waiting in the transit area we've been here for about two and a half hours we got around one and a half hour more to go and then hopefully they start boarding on time because I just want to get to Vegas now I just want to get into the apartment and chill 40 minutes of the transit time was spent in immigration because there was a few issues and literally like our heart was just beating like bah, 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 bah. are we gonna get sent back are we not but everything's fine they cleared us we got them stamps welcome to America baby so now yeah we're just waiting like how he said an hour and a half left and then it's actually an hour and a half flight all the way to Vegas. And then we're gonna be in Vegas! Uh, <laughs> DK family! DK family's so, out in Vegas like out in Vegas, crazy. Baby. Vegas. Vegas. Do I look Vegasy? Yeah, you, you know you look internationally. Hey, you hear that? Oh. Internationally. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, you know that. Mr. International, I love you, baby. Hey, that's my new name. That's my new hey, that's my new name. Call me Mr. International. <laughs> Minta International. Minta International. <laughs> <laughs> Our next flight is going to be with Alaska Airways. That's a one and a half hour flight all the way to Las Vegas, baby. So we're going to see you guys on that flight and see you in Las Vegas. compared to the flights we've been on for the past months. Like, it feels like a little coach. Yeah. Everyone just all packed together and this yeah. flight is fully packed out today as well. Saying the flight time is going to be one hour and six minutes so that's basically a Netflix episode. As soon as you step off the plane, straight into gambling. <laughs> <laughs> now you know you're in Vegas. We have to go to the baggage claim section and get our suitcase. They said to take a red line train and go to Terminal 3. So right now we're trying to find where that train is. We found the train, it's going to take us to Terminal 3. Alright, so our one is going to be Carousel 20. Carousel 20 is all the way down there, so I'm gonna run to it quickly. Hell's Kitchen. Did you see it? Yeah. 